I wanted to give you a little bit of a toolbox talk today, um, which is covering basically making some thick and thin merino hand spun yarn. Um, I love spinning this yarn. I can spin um, a, a plain, you know, however many plies yarn, it's all sort of the same size, but it is so fun to spin a thick and thin yarn. And I figure if you're going to put the effort in to make a yarn by hand, um, it might as well be interesting um, because like if you want a plain yarn, like you can go to the store and get some from the mill. The mill is better at making a plain old yarn every day. <laughs> so, but that's just my opinion and my thoughts. Um, so, uh, here we go. Right now she's so sewing the wool. Spinning. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's kind of fun the way some of these thick parts kind of spin really fast. Hey? Yes. Okay, now I want to show you how <laughs> how I add more to um, the end when I come to the end of my wool, which I'm coming right up to. Yeah. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah. So here's the end, and I want to show you the magic of adding more. So you may want to back up just a little, or I'll just do it here. So your your wool comes in this really wide, thick um, strip, and it's easier to draft if you pull it apart into a thinner piece. And I love this part because it's like pulling apart cotton candy. Oh, that's like, um, that's like connecting like a little piece of cotton candy. What were you gonna say? And then it also and and it's also like um um play-doh that it just sticks together and you don't even have to take it apart again. It's already perfect. Mm -hmm. Now the skein is off the skein winder and you can see how the twist is not set yet. And it has all these beautiful little curly cues in it that really, like, I love unset thick and thin yarn. It just looks so interesting and so much texture. So then this is a two yard skein. So each trip around here is two yards. And yes, you love yarn too. And so now, and I have another pound and a half of this to spin. So I'm just going to twist this up on itself. And wrap it around itself. And there you have a beautiful skein ready to be put of into the dye pot. Of yeah. yarn. <laughs> 